In the annals of history, there are secrets buried deep beneath the layers of time. Some remain hidden, veiled by the passage of years, while others are carefully guarded from prying eyes and curious minds. Some of the stones at Stonehenge are 50 and 70 tons. Some of the stones are even heavier. So how could you have moved these into place where the blue stones, the spotted dolerite, came from within Stonehenge? Now, the US authorities kept one damning secret for 80 long years. And now that it's out in the open, the whole world has been left in a state of complete shock. So, what exactly is this dark secret? And why has the US government suddenly decided to let go of it? Join us as we unravel 20 of the greatest mysteries ever in human history. Number 20. The Ghost Blimp The mystery of the Ghost Blimp begins on August 16, 1942, when a U.S. Navy blimp named L-8 embarked from Treasure Island in San Francisco Bay. Its mission was routine, to patrol for submarines off the coast of California. Guiding the blimp were two skilled pilots, Lieutenant Ernest Dwight Cody and Ensign Charles Ellis Adams. However, as the hours passed, something went awry. Instead of staying over the ocean, the L-8 drifted back over land and eventually crashed onto a street in Daly City, California. When Navy personnel arrived at the crash site, they made a perplexing discovery. The blimp itself was undamaged but Cody and Adams were nowhere to be found. Oddly, the blimp's doors were open, the radio still worked, and the emergency life raft remained on board. There were no signs of a struggle or any clue as to what had happened to the missing pilots. Despite an extensive search, neither Cody nor Adams were ever located. The incident sparked a flurry of theories, ranging from a daring escape to enemy capture or even alien abduction. Yet, no concrete evidence emerged to support any of these assumptions. This mysterious disappearance has since been called the Ghost Blimp Incident, remaining one of the most confusing mysteries of World War II aviation. Number 19. Flan and Isle. Mystery. In December 1900, something unusual happened on the lonely Flan and Isles, just off the rugged coast of Scotland. Three dedicated lighthouse keepers, James Duckett, Thomas Marshall, and Donald MacArthur, vanished without leaving a single clue behind. These men were the sole occupants of the tiny Eileen Moore Island, where they diligently tended to the lighthouse. On December 26th, a boat meant to relieve them of their duties arrived at the island, only to find the lighthouse empty. A thorough search ensued, but the keepers were nowhere to be found. Inside the lighthouse, everything seemed weirdly undisturbed. The table was set for a meal, a chair was knocked over, and their oil skins and boots lay abandoned, hinting that they had rushed out suddenly. Theories about their disappearance have abounded over the years, ranging from the possibility of a massive wave sweeping them away to the idea of a tragic end due to conflicts among the men or even supernatural forces at play. Some speculate that they might have been overwhelmed by a sudden storm while securing equipment, yet no bodies were ever recovered, leaving the true cause of their vanishing a perplexing mystery. This perplexing incident has since become a renowned ghost tale, inspiring countless books, articles, and fictional retellings. Number 18. The Demise of the Maya Civilization the Maya civilization, celebrated for its remarkable advancements in art, architecture, and mathematics, has long intrigued historians due to its mysterious disappearance. While many societies have risen and fallen over time, the vanishing act of the Maya stands as a mysterious puzzle. Before the arrival of European colonizers, the region housed various indigenous peoples, including the renowned Aztecs, Incas, and Mayans. The sudden abandonment of their once thriving cities leaving behind breathtaking pyramids, magnificent palaces, and complicated observatories, adds to the attraction of this ancient mystery. Interestingly, the Maya reached their zenith between 250 and 900 AD, but by around 1050 AD, their urban centers lay deserted, prompting assumptions about their fate. Scientists have proposed several theories to unravel this captivating secret. 
Some argue that a severe drought, leading to a drastic reduction in rainfall, may have been a significant factor. Others suggest that internal conflicts and wars tore the fabric of Maya society apart, supported by evidence of battles. However, the true cause of their demise remains elusive, memorializing an enduring historical puzzle that continues to captivate scholars and enthusiasts alike. Number 17. Reincarnation of the Pollock Sisters In 1957, the Pollock family faced an unimaginable tragedy. Their beloved daughters, Jacqueline and Joanna, were tragically lost in a devastating car accident. The weight of their daughters' untimely deaths cast a dark shadow over their once-balanced family life. This led to frequent arguments and even thoughts of divorce. However, against all odds, a miracle unfolded on October 4, 1958. On that fateful day, twin girls were born to Mistress Pollock, named Jillian and Jennifer. As the girls grew, their parents noticed some astonishing traits. Despite never being shown these toys, the daughters constantly requested toys that once belonged to their deceased sisters. Furthermore, Jennifer bore an uncanny resemblance to Jacqueline with an identical birthmark and a mole on her forehead that corresponded to Jacqueline's scar from a childhood fall. Strangely enough, whenever a car passed by, the twin girls would become panicked. These remarkable occurrences left the head of the family convinced that their first daughters had been reborn, returning to the same family. This extraordinary account aroused fervent debates. While Canadian-American psychiatrist Ian Stevenson found evidence supporting the happening of rebirth and garnered support from several individuals, the majority dismissed it as a mere fabrication orchestrated to attract media attention. Number 16. Stonehenge. Stonehenge, nestled in the English county of Wiltshire, stands as a captivating marvel from ancient times. It's like a big circle made of 30 huge stones, the tallest reaching up to 4 points 1 meter high and weighing more than 25 tons each. Imagine the effort it took to arrange these massive stones over 3 meters high. People have been pondering over Stonehenge for about 5,000 years, wondering who built it and how. Archaeologists have discovered clues nearby, suggesting that the people who made Stonehenge might have lived in a settlement close by. Yet, their identity remains a mystery. Some think they could have been Romans or Druids. Whatever their background, they likely saw Stonehenge as something sacred, maybe even an altar considering human remains were found around the site. How did they manage to move these colossal stones without modern machinery? Scientists have a few ideas. Some think they used animals and logs to drag the stones from a quarry. This incredible feat of engineering and organization probably took over a thousand years to complete. Some people believe aliens might have had a hand in building Stonehenge. It seems almost unbelievable that ancient humans could pull off such a feat without fancy tools. Number 15. Shroud of Turin Some people who don't believe in God say there's no proof that Jesus existed in real life. But the Orthodox and Catholic churches have a different view. They think the Shroud of Turin is evidence that Jesus was here on earth. This covering is a big piece of linen, about 4.37 meters long and 1.11 meters wide. It has a detailed imprint of a man's whole body on it. People believe this was the cloth Jesus was wrapped in after he was crucified. The imprint looks a lot like the pictures of Jesus that we see. They found this cloth in the 13 centuries, and now it's kept in Turin in a church called the Cathedral of St. John the Baptist. People see it as a holy relic. Scientists have studied it and found out it's probably not real. They used a method called radiocarbon dating and figured out that the cloth was made in the 12th century, not in Jesus' time. However, some people who doubt the covering's authenticity say, maybe the testing was wrong. They think maybe the cloth got some marks on it later that made it seem older. They also suggest that maybe scientists don't want to admit that God exists, so they're biased against the shroud being real. Number 14. 
Jack the Ripper. In the streets of London's East End during the autumn of 1888, a dark and mysterious figure prowled in the shadows. This sinister individual, known only as Jack the Ripper, struck fear into the hearts of the Whitechapel district. He mercilessly ended the lives of at least five women, all of whom were unfortunate prostitutes, leaving behind a chilling aura of horror and enigma. Each victim met a gruesome fate. Their bodies were found mutilated in eerily similar ways. The Ripper's signature was unmistakable, a deep cut across the throat followed by the removal of internal organs, executed with a precision that hinted at surgical expertise. Law enforcement spared no effort in their quest to apprehend the culprit. Countless suspects were interrogated, and hundreds of individuals were investigated. Yet, despite the exhaustive investigation and the intense public interest in the case, Jack the Ripper's true identity remained shrouded in mystery. Throughout the years, numerous theories have surfaced, implicating figures ranging from members of the royal family to artists and even the possibility of a female perpetrator. Speculation abounds regarding the Ripper's profession, with some suggesting a medical or butchery background due to the precise nature of the harm. Others theorize about potential connections to secret societies such as the Freemasons. Number 13. Shugborough Inscription For centuries, the serene gardens of Shugborough Hall in Staffordshire, England, have captivated the minds of historians and puzzle solvers alike. At the heart of this interest lies the Shepherd's Monument, an enigmatic 18th century sculpture adorned with a mirrored rendition of Nicholas Pan's painting, The Arcadian Shepherds. However, it's not the artwork that steals the spotlight. Rather, it's a cryptic inscription etched below the relief that has confounded scholars for generations. The inscription, comprising the letters O-U-O-S-V-A-V-V -V -V with D-M nestled beneath, has sparked a flurry of theories regarding its significance. Some speculate it conceals a secret message or the encrypted code of an ancient society. One particularly tantalizing theory links it to the fabled Holy Grail or the legendary treasures of the Knights Templar. Others believe the arrangement might be an anagram or a form of hidden writing, concealing secrets within its random sequence. Numerous attempts have been made to unravel its meaning, with some claiming connections to ancient Greek or Latin phrases. Yet, despite these efforts, no definitive interpretation has gained widespread acceptance among scholars. Even notable figures such as Charles Dickens and Charles Darwin's grandson have been drawn into the puzzle. Yet the true significance of the inscription remains elusive. Some doubters have proposed that the inscription could simply be a flighty prank organized by the monument's commissioners, Thomas Anson and his friend George Anson. Number 12. The Yonaguni Monument In 1986, while driving near Yonaguni Island in Okinawa to see hammerhead sharks, a man named Kichiro Arataki stumbled upon something extraordinary beneath the shallow waters. He discovered strange structures that seemed completely out of place on the ocean floor. They looked like a pyramid with perfectly balanced edges, angles, and steps leading to its top. This rock formation, later dubbed the Yonaguni Monument, stands 25 meters tall, stretches 100 meters in length, and spans 60 meters in width. It's made of shale and sandstone that dates back 20 million years and covers a vast array of around 45,000 square meters. Professor Masaki Kimura, a Japanese marine geologist and seismology professor at the University of Ryukyu, dedicated 15 years to studying these mysterious rocks. His research led him to suggest that these stone formations were crafted by an advanced civilization that lived in an ancient city here over 10,000 years ago. However, some scientists remain doubtful, arguing that these formations are the result of natural processes. Despite this, 
The site continues to amuse divers and curious individuals who visit to witness this remarkable wonder, believing it to be remnants of an ancient city. Number 11. Flight MH370. The Disappearance of Malaysia Airlines. Flight 370 on March 8, 2014, stands out as one of the most puzzling and sorrowful aviation mysteries of our time. This incident involved a Boeing 777 airplane with 239 passengers and crew aboard, which mysteriously disappeared from radar screens during its journey from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, to Beijing, China. This sudden disappearance left behind a trail of unresolved questions and shattered families. The flight commenced its journey from Kuala Lumpur International Airport at 19 minutes to 1 a.m. local time, with an anticipated arrival in Beijing at 30 minutes after 6 a.m. However, barely an hour into the flight, the aircraft lost contact with air traffic control over the South China Sea. The last communication from the plane was a routine good night message from the co-pilot. In the days and weeks following the disappearance, an extensive international search and rescue mission was launched, involving numerous countries and covering a vast area of the Indian Ocean. Despite the combined efforts of ships, aircraft, and submarines equipped with state-of-the-art technology, no solid evidence regarding the whereabouts of the plane was discovered. As the search persisted, Various theories surfaced, attempting to explain the aircraft's disappearance. Some speculated that the plane might have suffered a catastrophic mechanical failure, while others suggested the possibility of hijacking or deliberate diversion by one of the pilots. Number 10. Beel Sifirs. The Beel Sifirs are like ancient puzzles, hiding secrets of a hidden fortune. It all started when James Beverly Ward shared them in a small booklet, but the one who wrote the original message chose to stay a mystery back in 1820. In a quaint town named Lynchburg, Virginia, there was a meeting between Robert Morris, who ran the Washington Hotel, and a skilled hunter named Thomas Jefferson Beale. They clicked instantly, and Beale became a regular at the hotel. Whenever he went off for his errands, he'd always return to the comfort of the hotel. But in 1822, he left Morris with a locked iron box, promising to come back in two years. However, Beale never returned, leaving Morris puzzled. He waited a whole decade before even considering opening the box, and it took him another 13 years to finally unlock it. Inside were pages filled with nothing but numbers. Beale had once mentioned treasures near Buford City, leading Morris to believe the numbers held the key to the riches. Many tried to crack the code, and one breakthrough revealed a passage from the Declaration of Independence. This confirmed Beale's tale of a hidden fortune, estimated at a whopping $30 million today. Number 9. The Bermuda Triangle The Bermuda Triangle is famous for being one of the most mysterious spots on Earth. Strange events happen here often, causing ships, planes, and people to vanish without explanation. But what's behind all this mystery? Located in the vast expanse of the Sargasso Sea between Miami, the Bermuda Islands, and San Juan in Puerto Rico, the Bermuda Triangle covers an area of about 700,000 square kilometers. It sits right along popular routes for ships and planes traveling from the Caribbean Sea to Europe and from the U.S. East Coast to South America. Shipwrecks and plane crashes aren't uncommon here. Some folks think it's because of something eerie like the legendary lost city of Atlantis, or maybe even extraterrestrial interference. But scientists have a different take. They say the disappearances are likely due to the tricky navigation in the area, with its numerous shoals, unpredictable cyclones, and storms. While conspiracy theorists love to spin tales about the Triangle's mysterious aura, experts argue that it's just a dangerous but not unique stretch of ocean. There are plenty of other places around the world where ships and planes have met their end under similar circumstances. Number 8. Dyatlov Pass In February 1959, a team of nine skilled Russian hikers led by Igor Dyatlov 
set out on a skiing adventure in the chilly northern Ural Mountains. This diverse group, comprising eight men and one woman, were all students or graduates from the Ural Polytechnic Institute. However, their mission took a dark turn on the night of February 1st. Something startled the hikers, causing them to flee their tent in a panic, leaving behind their clothes and shoes despite the bone-chilling 22 degrees Fahrenheit temperatures. Days later, investigators made a grim discovery. The hikers' bodies scattered across the snowy slope. Some suffered fatal injuries, like fractured skulls and broken ribs. What's strange is that there were no signs of a struggle, and some were found barely dressed, wearing only underwear. Soviet authorities initially chalked it up to an unknown compelling force, sparking wild theories ranging from avalanches to secret military experiments gone awry. Yet the true cause of this chilling incident known as the Dyatlov Pass Incident, remains a baffling mystery. This mysterious case has captured imaginations worldwide, generating numerous books, documentaries, and even a Hollywood film. It's a puzzle that persists into the 21st century, cementing its status as one of the most captivating mysteries of the modern era. Number 7. The Dancing Plague during the summer of 1518, Strasbourg, a city in France, experienced a strange and puzzling event known as the Dancing Plague. It all started when a woman named Frau Trophea stepped out onto the streets and began dancing with great intensity, unable to stop. Soon, others joined her, and within a week, dozens of people were dancing alongside her. By the end of the month, the streets were packed with hundreds of individuals dancing uncontrollably. The dancing went on for days and, in some cases, even weeks, with participants only stopping when they collapsed from exhaustion, suffered a stroke, or had a heart attack. Some danced so actively that their feet became bruised and bloody. Local authorities, baffled by this happening, hired musicians to play music, thinking it might help the dancers stop. However, the dancing continued relentlessly. The cause of the dancing plague remains a mystery, with various theories proposed. Some believe it was a case of mass psychogenic illness, where psychological factors triggered physical symptoms in a group of people. Others suggest urgo, poisoning from contaminated rye bread could have been a factor. There are even beliefs that it might have been a manifestation of religious fervor or a response to the extreme stress and difficulties faced by the people of Strasbourg at that time. Number 6. The Aluminum Wedge of Ayud. Back in 1974, something strange was dug up near the Mures River, not far from Ayud, a city in Romania. Imigini being buried beneath 35 feet of sand alongside the ancient bones of a mastodon, which is like an old-school version of an elephant. This discovery was no ordinary find. The object, resembling the head of a hammer, was crafted from an aluminum alloy, a material they usually associate with modern times. It was supposedly more than 11,000 years old. That's like finding a smartphone in a cave painting. The artifact ended up in the hands of experts at the Archaeological Institute of Cluj-Napoca, who determined its composition, 12 different elements, wrapped in a thin oxide layer. Aluminum wasn't even discovered until way later, in 1808, let alone being made by people until 1885. This so-called Ayud wedge has got scientists scratching their heads, trying to figure out how it ended up there so long ago, long before humans were supposed to have known about aluminum. In the heart of Washington District of Columbia, buried beneath the layers of history and politics, lies a profound secret that could shake the very foundations of the world we live in. For 80 years, the United States authorities have guarded this secret with utmost secrecy, fearing its revelation could rewrite the course of history. It all began in 1944, during the height of World War II, when a secret government project was initiated deep within the boundaries of a classified facility. The brightest minds of the era were brought together, their mission shrouded in mystery, their task is to unlock the secrets of an unearthly artifact recovered from the wreckage of a downed aircraft. 
As the war raged on, whispers of the project spread like wildfire among the select few with knowledge of its existence. Assumptions ran rampant, ranging from extraterrestrial origins to divine intervention. Yet, the truth remained veiled behind layers of security clearance and sworn oaths of secrecy. Decades passed, and the artifact remained hidden from prying eyes, its significance known only to a privileged few. Generations of government officials came and went, each sworn to uphold the clandestine pact that bound them to silence. Then, in the year 2024, an unexpected turn of events unfolded. A courageous whistleblower, disillusioned by the government's veil of secrecy, risked everything to expose the truth to the world. With irrefutable evidence in hand, they revealed the existence of the artifact and the decades long cover up to a stunned global audience. The revelation sent shockwaves through the corridors of power, sparking fierce debates and soul searching across the nation. Questions that had lingered unanswered for eight decades now demanded resolution. What was the true nature of the artifact? What secrets did it hold? And most importantly, why was it kept hidden from the world for so long? Share your opinions in the comments below. Number 5. Elisa Lam's Haunting Disappearance Elisa Lam, a young woman aged 21, whose parents moved from Hong Kong to Vancouver, embarked on a trip to Southern California in February 2013. She was studying at the University of British Columbia. Before her disappearance, she regularly stayed in touch with her family. She arrived in Los Angeles on February 19, 2013, and checked into a hotel called The Cecil, known for its eerie history. This hotel had been a temporary residence for notorious serial killers, witnessed multiple murders, and served as a site for numerous suicides. Shortly after Elisa arrived at the Cecil, she vanished. Her body was discovered in a water tank on the hotel's rooftop only after maintenance workers responded to guest complaints about the water quality. Authorities initially concluded that she had taken her own life due to a lack of evidence implicating anyone else. However, the hotel's elevator surveillance footage added a layer of mystery to the case. The video shows Elisa behaving strangely in the elevator, entering and exiting multiple times, talking and gesturing as if talking with someone who isn't there, and even seemingly hiding from an unseen presence. Curiously, the elevator malfunctions only when she is inside. The unresolved nature of the case, coupled with the eerie footage, has led to various theories ranging from mental health issues like bipolar disorder to more supernatural explanations. Number 4. Pascagoula UFO Abduction On the night of October 11, 1973, two workers from a shipyard, Charles Hickson and Calvin Parker, were out fishing by the Pascagoula River in Mississippi when they said something extraordinary happened. They were taken by aliens. They described seeing a bright egg-shaped craft landing nearby, and from it emerged three beings who looked human, but were about five feet tall, with wrinkled gray skin and hands that looked like claws. According to their account, these creatures somehow made Charles and Calvin unable to move and then floated them into their craft. Once inside, they underwent a strange examination before being let go. After telling the local sheriff's department what happened, they were left alone in a room with a hidden microphone, recording their conversation about the frightening experience. Later on, both men took lie detector tests, which they passed, adding weight to their story. This event, known as the Pascagoula UFO abduction, gained widespread attention across the country and is still one of the most famous alleged encounters with aliens in history. While some doubt the truth of their story, suggesting it might have been a made-up tale or a trick of the mind, others remain fascinated by it. Number 3. The Disappearance of Walter Collins Back in 1928, a big commotion stirred up across the United States when young Walter Collins, a nine-year-old from Los Angeles, vanished into thin air. It all started on a regular day in March when Walter, all excited to catch a movie, left home. But he never made it back. His worried mother, Christine Collins, took immediate action, 
reporting him missing to the Los Angeles Police Department. They launched a massive hunt to find him. Months dragged on with no sign of Walter until a boy claiming to be him turned up in Deal, Illinois. Christine rushed to see the boy, hoping against hope that it was her son. But as soon as she saw him, she knew in her heart that he wasn't Walter. Despite her protests, the police insisted she take the boy home. When Christine remained adamant, refusing to accept the imposter, the LAPD took drastic measures. They had her committed to a psychiatric hospital, trying to silence her. It later came to light that the boy claiming to be Walter was a young trickster named Arthur Hutchins Jr. He had cooked up the whole story to enjoy a free trip to Hollywood. The mishandling of the case by the LAPD from disbelieving Christine to trying to cover up their errors sparked fury among the public. Number two, Cleopatra. Cleopatra, one of Egypt's famous queens, is remembered for her brilliance, education, and vibrant personality. Even today, people are fascinated by her life story. Born in 69 BC in Alexandria, Cleopatra hailed from the Ptolemaic dynasty, established by Ptolemy I Soter, one of Alexander the Great's successors. Despite not being of Egyptian descent, she made concerted efforts to immerse herself in the culture and traditions of her people. Cleopatra went beyond expectations by becoming the first ruler of her dynasty to master the Egyptian language. She also embraced the attire typically worn by Egyptian queens. Her magnetic presence had a mesmerizing effect on many, leading even powerful Roman generals like Julius Caesar and Mark Antony to fall under her spell. Her relationship with Mark Antony was particularly notable for its depth of affection on both sides. However, the circumstances surrounding Cleopatra's death remain shrouded in mystery. It's widely believed she took her own life to avoid falling into the hands of Octavian, who would have likely made her his prisoner. Despite numerous archaeological endeavors, Cleopatra's tomb has eluded discovery. Yet, recent findings by the Dominican Archaeological Mission offer new hope. Artifacts linked to Cleopatra's irae have been unearthed at the Temple of Taposiris, along with evidence of a complex network of tunnels and chambers. Archaeologist Kathleen Martinez believes that within these chambers lie the final resting places of Cleopatra and Mark Antony. Number 1. Amelia Earhart. Amelia Mary. Earhart was an adventurous woman who made history in 1928 as the first female pilot to fly solo across the Atlantic Ocean when she was 31 years old. By the time she turned 40, she had become a celebrated figure in aviation, achieving remarkable success. She decided to take on an even more daring challenge, to fly around the world before retiring. On May 20, 1937, Earhart, along with her navigator Fred Noonan, embarked on their final record-breaking flight. They flew a twin-engine Lockheed Electra monoplane and had covered about 80% of the total distance by early July, flying over the vast expanses of the Atlantic, Africa, Arabia, India, and Southeast Asia. Their next destination was Howland Island, a small spot in the vastness of the Pacific Ocean, where they planned to refuel before continuing their journey. However, finding the island proved to be a daunting task especially with the navigation tools available at the time. Despite the presence of a Coast Guard ship near the island's shores, Earhart and Noonan were unable to locate Howland. Their last messages indicated they were running out of fuel. Sadly, they never reached their destination. Extensive searches for their plane and remains yielded nothing for many years. It wasn't until January 2024 that wreckage belonging to Earhart's plane was discovered in the Pacific Ocean by divers from the company Deep Sea Vision. However, no human remains were found. What are your thoughts on the greatest mysteries of humanity that the United States authorities kept secret for 80 years? Share your opinions in the comments below.